Hi everybody, my name is Yashodhya from Sri Lanka and today I'm going to tell you how to do maths perfectly. Yeah, for grade 2 students and for grade 1 students, you find it a little hard to do the methods that the teacher told you, right? Yes, it can be very difficult sometimes. So I'm going to tell you in a very easy way to do maths. So I'm going to show you, I'm going to share my presentation. I'm going to show you the easiest way to do maths and the perfect way for little children to quickly understand. Okay, I hope you all enjoy my video. So, maths for grade 2 and 1 students. I hope you enjoy this video. So, when, the, when you get a question like this, this sign is called minus. This sign is called minusing. Can you see? That is called minusing. So, see, you, it's kind of hard to get the answer, right? You have no idea what to do and it's confusing and all and you don't know what to do. You're, you're confused, right? Well, I'm going to show you an easier way. First, to do this, you need to write 41. You need to draw a line. And you need to write 41 here and 53 here. So how we are going to do is it like you have to jump. How to go to 50? How to go to 50, right? You ask. To go to 50 is how to go to 50. Did you know that if you add 49 plus 1 equals 50? So then the uh, then it's going the then the answer is going to be 50. But let's add another 3 to the number 50. So 1, 2, 3. So can you understand? Maybe uh, let's change the numbers to 48. So if we change it to 48, what will happen? What's 48 plus 1? What's the answer? Yes, the answer is 49. So we, the, we have to go to 50. To go to 50, we need 2. So if you add 4, 48 plus 2 equals 50. 48, 49, 50. So when you get 50, um, this time, yeah, when you get 50, um, you, this, this time it's going to be 5. It's going to be 55 this time. It's going to be 55. So is this correct? 50 plus 3 equals 53. How many, how many more numbers do we want? Hmm. That's correct, my dear friends. We need two more numbers. So we are going to delete this and write three, four, five. All together, the answer is five. See, ta-da! It's super easy. It's so easy to learn. It's kind of really easy, especially in this method. It's special made for you all. So let's start the other one. Did you know? Now let's start plus. So you can write this down, but don't write these two ones down, okay? You should know always think that you need to start in the last number. Yes, you should start in these last numbers, but, but don't even think about the one. Just think about these five and seven numbers. So let's add 7 plus 5. 7 plus 5 equals 12. But how can we put the whole number there? So forget the number 1 and just write the last number and just write 2. So then the, the remaining number is 1. Then you need to put it on top if, or in the middle number and now you have to plus it. So 7, 8, 9, 10. Answers 10. So you can't write the whole number there. So you have to write 0. 
10, the last number of 10 is zero. So you have to write zero. But there is something very tricky. There's something really tricky about the first three, about the, the first numbers. Then when 10, you get another one over here. So when you get the other one, and you need you older or no matter what answer you get, um, older or what if you get 12? What if you get 12? Don't cut the number. You have to write the whole number. So I got five, six, seven. So the answer for that is 72. It's super easy. Also, this is a fact that you always got to remember while doing this thing. This is an easy trick. Maybe your teacher might be surprised and think that you are very smart. Also, always think that you need to start in, in the last number, okay? And that in, that in the first one, you always need to count whatever number you get, like 21. If you get 21, you have to write the whole number down. Don't get scared. Just write the whole number down. You need to write the whole number, not only the last number that is important. If you did not do that, your answer um, is kind of going to be wrong. So let's go to the next slide. You should learn maths. It depends in your life. You have to learn maths. So you can uh, you can stop this video and write these numbers down. Well, the only important number is to 30. It's more than enough. But if you want to be extra smart and be, be super good to the teacher, you can write all the numbers down. And then you may be the smartest kid in the class. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Can you all understand that there is a trick here? 11, 12, forget about these two numbers. See, third. Can you understand? Team, every, every, every each of these numbers have team. So you know how to say 13 to 19 without getting scared. Always remember, tell the number and tell teen with it. But don't say, tw but don't say 20 teen. That's really wrong. Nine, at the teen. Eight, teen. Seven, teen. 21, this is another platform, see? 21, just write, just write 20 and the other numbers with it. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. It goes on all the, all along. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 51, 52, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 38, 9, and 100. See, don't, don't, don't think about this last box. You don't really need, you don't really need to think about the last box, okay? It's too much. Now, you are very smart. You have learned a lot today. I hope you like it. So, uh, most people ask about division, right? Well, I know. For grade three, for grade three children, I mean grade four, and well, for grade three children, 
Well, it's super, super hard to keep their mind in, in division, division and multiplication. I'll tell you those, I'll tell you that in my next video. I hope you enjoy. Also, don't forget to subscribe and like. Why don't we do something really fun today, huh? You have to like and subscribe in 10 seconds with your thumb. See if you can accept the challenge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I, if you did it, give yourself a pat on the back. So I hope you all enjoy. You are going, and now your brain's going to grow faster than a cheetah. Well, I hope you all enjoy. It was a pleasure working with you today. I love you all. Um, I hope that you enjoy this lesson. I hope that now you know that maths is really important and also super easy to do. And division, you think that division is hard? There is an easier way to do division. I'll tell you all in the next video. Have a nice day. I love you all. 348 kisses all for you. Bye, everybody. I hope you enjoy my video, video and like and subscribe. So, bye. Have a nice day.